Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. So I am back today with another collaboration. This time with Amy Winter from Winter's Craft Studio. Um, so this is kind of an exciting one and definitely a bit terrifying for me. It's more of a mixed media collab. So she painted this wig head. There's a canvas that came with it too, but I'm just doing the wig head here. And we talked about this beforehand, decided on kind of steampunk themed. So that's why the colors here. And then I'm going to be embellishing it mixed media style. So I got a bunch of things. I got all these uh, chipboard cutouts from a store on Etsy called Creative Embellishments. I got some metal gears. <laughs> I have gold on my hands. I got some metal gears from Amazon. Um, I have my liquid gilding. So I'm going to kind of just go to town on this. I will speed this up, throw some music behind it, and then I'll just pop up with words telling you about the materials that I am using. And the materials will, of course, all be listed in the description. So let's get started.
right, I think I'm officially done. This took quite a few days. <laughs> um, and it went from cyborg to steampunk a bit. So, um, while I did have the pop-up words, I'm just gonna go through and kind of explain the materials that I used. So these papers were actually from my original architectural plans, the blueprints for my art studio that I used to have. And I've been saving these plans, trying to think of some fun projects. So this is the first time I've used them. I glued those on and then put some of these uh, kind of steampunkish stamps. Obviously we've got lots of gears. I added a little key here. So this is a mixture of metal and the chipboard gears. I put a whole bunch down here. It really needed something to take it from that cyborg to, uh, you know, steampunk. So I added the mustache and also this chain, which makes this more into like an eyeglass piece. And then a bunch of the uh, gilding and some of the silver liquid gilding as well. So I think that's pretty much everything. I'm gonna actually take you down for a side view so you can get the full picture here. All right, so here is the actual view. So you can see how that chain hangs like that. That was kind of my last step there. So I just wanna say thank you so much to Amy for this collab, it was a lot of fun. And if you guys can do me a favor, go down in the description, check out all of her links, show her some love and let us know what you think of this project down in the comments. We'll see you all next time.